I guess it's twofold uh, the, the purpose. Uh, number one is uh, how to get families uh, in the neighborhood, uh, give them a voice. The other piece is to try to first meet some of the basic needs in the community. My role here at Dominican Center as a lead abatement coordinator is to form property owners of the Childhood Lead Abatement Program to educate the community of lead hazards and basically to screen applicants for appropriate um, information to uh, qualify for the program. The ultimate goal is really to empower the people that they can be educated to know different um, lead hazards that's going on in a home or everything that we offer here they be because our main thing is to educate people that they can feel and know the importance of keeping a home safe that their community could be safe. But the, the biggest thing is is the abatement piece is really going into going into the homes and replacing windows that was part of the program too that was the other part is that they would take out all the lead windows and replace those with new windows. It's, it's great. It's much better than it was, you know, uh, the windows that was here in the past. Uh, these are, are just tremendous, uh, uh, better than what it was, you know, so I really appreciate it. Well, to me, that uh, is a exceedingly uh, a plus, you know, for us when I have company or something like that, you know, I don't have to worry about them uh, picking up... Uh, getting any kind of toxic or, you know, get sick or anything like that. So it's, it's, it's a great help. It has had a big impact. And uh, what we're pushing is that let's target the houses because this family may live in this house for a couple of years, but they may move down the street, and that house is, has lead in it. So until we start targeting the houses, I don't think we're going to totally eliminate the problem.